Released in 2002 alongside the movie it was based on, Spider-Man is an action game that sees you swinging around the city fighting petty criminals and full-on supervillains. The plot of this game is loosely based on the movie, but with many more characters added in to pad the runtime. I never had an issue with this, as movies only ever scratch the surface of Spider-Man's great cast of characters. This game takes heavy inspiration in its gameplay from the previous two Spider-Man games released for the PS1, the creatively named Spider-Man, and its sequel, Spider-Man 2 Enter Electro. I like to think of this game we're checking out today as a sort of bridge between the new and old generation of Spider-Man games. This is bringing back so many memories. Okay. Why does this actually go hard? This is awesome. I love this. That's so hype. So much nostalgia. This menu theme is amazing too. Before I get too off track, let's just go into the game. Training, sure, why not? Greetings. It appears to me I've forgotten something. Greetings. Welcome to the tutorial. Look at that PS2 Tobey Maguire right there. Hey. All things considered, I mean, he does look like Tobey Maguire. If I saw that, I would definitely say, like, yeah, that's Tobey Maguire. Now, these question marks will teach you how to use your powers. It's a circle. Check out the compass. Oh. Up on the compass means forward to you. You follow me? Well, stop following me or I'll have you arrested. That probably confused so many kids, man. This is incredible! Am I really doing this? Well, you're easily impressed, aren't you? You haven't even gotten to the good stuff yet. Yes, in this universe, Toby learned how to be Spider-Man within a void with red grid lines everywhere. It's a little bit of a departure from the movie, but still interesting. You can recenter the camera behind you by pressing the target camera down key. What? Why did his voice do that? He definitely only wanted to do one take, and they were like, uh, how do we make this fit for every single possible console? And they were like, yeah, instead of saying press X, just say press the target camera lock on button. Press the web swing key to start the web swing. <laughs> Not his finest yeah! work. Here's a little party favor for you. A combo power-up. Oh, and for those of you with short-term memory issues, which would be most of you, wow. you can check out a list of the combos you've unlocked in the pause menu. I'm sorry, I've already forgot what he said. All right, kiddo, let's see what you got. What you doing up here, pestle neck? What is that? I was up here first. <sighs> this is too cool. I love killing people. I'm gonna grab a ham sandwich. Whenever you're done beating bad guys up, follow your compass and height meter. I wish I had a ham sandwich. Okay, so here you are on the side of a building. You actually got With it. With a zip line key while crawling on a wall, you'll web zip in the direction you're crawling. The zip line key? How is a kid supposed to know what the zip line key is, man? You just display it on the screen or something. It's Z for me. But it could have been like numpad 52 or something. Oh. Like, come on. If you press the web combo key, and then press zip line, the yo-yo, ladies and gentlemen, good luck. That did not teach me anything. If I was a kid, I would be hopelessly lost. How do I escape the tutorial? I'm stuck. Help, somebody. We're going on here at difficulty because I don't think I've ever played at this difficulty, and I'm probably about to regret this. This is how my story begins. My Uncle Ben and Aunt May raised me like a son. The last time I saw Uncle Ben alive, we argued. Poor Bonesaw never even saw me coming. Mr. Nice Guy. I don't know who that is, but that's not Bonesaw. The fight promoter cheated me, so I didn't think it was my problem when he got robbed. Somebody, stop him! 1200, call back on that 187 in connection with the carjacking at the 42nd Street Library. And for suspect police to be a member of the Skulls Gang, proceed with caution. Not the Skulls Gang. I have to find the guy who did it. There's nothing Peter Parker can do at this point. But Spider-Man is a different story. Oh yeah. Now I may be mistaken, but I believe the suspect is a member of the Skulls gang. This is supposed to be the Skulls territory. I'll find Uncle Ben's killer if I have to go through every one of the Skulls to do it. That's what I'm saying. Alright, let's go. Hey, you! Come get some. You lost, kid? I want answers! Oh my gosh. 
I'm mad. They didn't know anything, but I'm just getting started. They could have known something, but you just killed them. Okay, fine. I think now would be as good a time as ever to mention that back in these days before Spider-Man 2, the movie game had the first ever open world Spider-Man game. Well, if you don't already know what happens when you fall down here. <laughs> That is so lame, man. You just die instantly when you fall down there. Before we continue this, I have to do the optional side quest that I do every time I play this mission. Hey, get away from her. He doesn't look so tough. Thank you so much. You saved my life. Don't worry about it, lady. I gotta go. Wait, before you go, I lost my purse on one of the rooftops around here. On a different rooftop? Yes. Are you serious? <laughs> it's so stupid, you. dude. Thank you. Makes no sense at all. I think it's this one. Yeah, I see it. With some punks minding their business down here. Gonna get answers one way or the other. That's what I'm talking about, Spider-Man. Let's get him. Another dead end. Well, one of these losers is gonna give me some answers. All right, we got that purse. Now let's get it back to this insane woman. Why is this even in this game, dude? Here's your purse back. Thank you so much. This city could use more masked vigilantes like you. Uh, if you say so. I hear that there's an evil villain's hideout somewhere in this city. We need to find it. Oh, look at that. Oh, I just fell off. Look at that. We found it. Oh my gosh, dude, I just flew at that guy like 500 miles per hour. Is there just random gang members on rooftops? Like, not even You're part of so this? Dead. Oh my... I guess that takes care of that. Get Here, him give me a piggyback ride. Get him off. There you go. Ow, stop. Not so tough now, huh? I love that sound they make when they die. Gordon Freeman, you're gonna pay. A carjacker killed an old man earlier today. The killer's a skull. Where is he? He's probably in that old shipping warehouse. It's right on the river. <laughs> That's literally the worst voice acting I've ever heard. Come on, let's go. Before he kills two uncles. Sounds like the police are closing in. They can have whatever's left after I'm done. Ruthless Spider-Man. What's this door doing open? Man! People gotta be more careful. The cops could show up at any time. Oh my gosh, dude. This game is so nostalgic. I used to play this game. Uh, the first time I played this game, I think it was... Uh, we were going with my brother to get braces or something, and it was like the orthodontist, and they had a GameCube set up, and I played this game. And I remember, distinctly remember, I got stuck on the first mission because I didn't know what to do. And I was really mad that you couldn't play in the normal Spider-Man suit, like you had to play as the human spider. It's so nostalgic though. This game was actually one of the first walkthroughs I ever did on this channel. It's deleted now because it was terrible quality, but this and Hulk 2003. So it brings back a lot of memories to revisit it. Do you think they can see me? Huh? The stealth in this level is literally impossible. I have no idea. Here, we have to complete this stealth. I guess stealth is not an option. Never mind. I'm gonna take you down. Leave him to me. Take a tire, take a tire, take a tire, take a tire. Okay. Here, take a tire. Stop shooting me, man. I'm literally unarmed. Ow! You don't get to do it. You don't get to disrespect me like that and live. Come on. Ah, oh, here we are. How was I supposed to get in here stealthily? Looks like the free wants to Out of my way. Circus in town? Yeah. Oh! Here I was excited to see the circus. Come on. What's wrong? Like, you got a stomach ache or something? The least convincing death sounds I've ever heard in a game. Hey, look, here's a little secret for all you at home. Why do you have to... That's a weird thing about this game. You have to pick up web collectibles. Because there is a meter for your webs, but he has organic webs in the movie. Stop right there, murderer! The only guy who has a unique character model in this entire place. It must be Uncle Ben's killer. He ain't getting through. He literally just stole the switch. What? 
How do you even get an idea like that? Spider-Man, I don't think I would go that far. Please, somebody help me. Oh wait, I forgot I'm a superhero. Here, hey, don't kick the tire out of my hand. Here, catch. I have to kill him with tires. This guy is invincible. Okay, maybe tires are not the correct thing to do. Come here, buddy. Back off, ugly. Shut up. Why was that so like sincere? Like I actually am personally offended now. Why did you tell me to shut up like that? All right, this time we're doing it right. Oh my gosh, dude. I didn't mean to kill him that hard. Okay. Run! How you like me now, punk? I'm not even going to give you the satisfaction of dying by my hand. I'm just going to leave you here to think about what you've done. I wonder if there's a real gang out there named the Skulls, and their only representation is the Spider-Man 2002 movie game. That should do it. Now to find the guy who killed Uncle Ben. Let's go. They've taken a fuse out of the control panel. I'll have to get that back if I want to open that door. Never mind. You messed with the wrong guy. Ah! You can throw a boombox at people. I love this game. Yeah, let's keep going. I don't have time Ow. for this. Ow. Ow. To okay, the Electro has invaded these vents. What's with the get I'm not even gonna let him get a hit in. Mess with the skulls, you pay the price. This guy is so strong, what the heck? Alright, we got him. This fuse should get that door open. This is where the fuse goes. Now I've got you. That was oddly complicated. Circus in town? I wonder if I can get this guy to go in the fire. Here, follow me. There's people that are under me that ran in the fire. They really, they seem mildly annoyed by it. They don't seem like they're dying. Must be losing it. Ow, hey, stop. Get out of my face, man. Yeah, that's it. Come here. There's health in there. All right, I'll be with you in one moment. Wait, wait, wait. One of them has a gun. Please. They do the splits when they die, I love that. Alright, warehouse hunt complete. The deeper we go into this warehouse. I love Ventral Spider-Man like right after Uncle Ben dies and in Spider-Man 3 when he gets the symbiote. It's kind of like the same deal, it's awesome, I love that. I wonder if that guy knows what's about to happen to him. Looks like the freak wants Apparently to he did because he saw me before Back I even off. showed up. Oh my gosh, dude, these guys have insane SMGs. Stop. Handspring. Out of my way. That's cool. Just blowing, blowing the whole place up. In town? Let's try my new combo. Who's that? That's cool. Oh my gosh. There are a lot of tires in here. Oh my gosh, dude, that- Whoever has the SMG down there, good job, because I'm really on the ropes now. Ah. Hey, you. I spotted my prey. Perfect, that's just what I needed. Watch to play. Oh my gosh, I'm almost dead again. That's what I get for playing this game on hard mode. Aw. Oh. Wait, what's in here? I just got into the enemy's spawn point. I'm gonna tear you to pieces. No! Why are they stand like that? Take this. Uh, uh. The problem isn't really that this game is hard, it's more like it's just clunky because there's so much input delay. I mean, that's how old games are, but it doesn't make it any more pleasant to play, does it? I swear this dude with this gun needs to die. Oh man, come on. I swear, this part is so hard. There it is. Not so tough now, huh? That took many waves of those enemies. Something tells me the killer is right around this corner. Something tells me I'm right. Ow. Oh my gosh, dude. He is packing heat. What is Freak. 
I'm actually at a loss for words right now. What just happened? Oh my gosh, dude. Go, go, Spider-Man. No, come on, man. What am I supposed to do against that? If only I respawned right here. But I have to do the entire level again. Okay. Two hours later. Okay, I need to save my health. Take this. What? You don't scare me, freak. You messed with the wrong guy. Yeah, that literally took like five seconds for me to jump. I was spamming spacebar. Wow, this guy's flying everywhere. Okay, come on. I don't know who you are, but you're dead meat. Oh, if I do this move, it hits him while he's down. Okay. That'll be a useful strategy. Finally! I swear, that guy took forever. No! Hugh! He is not even wearing a mask. How did it take you this long to realize who he was? I could have stopped you at the fight promoter's office. I could have saved Uncle Ben. That just took care of itself, didn't it? Not even gonna turn him in or anything. Save game, yes sir. These are the years when a man becomes the man he's going to be for the rest of his life. Just be careful who you change into. You're feeling this power of becoming a man. And with this great power comes great responsibility. Uncle Ben. Nothing could ever fill the hole left when he died. Those wounds never really heal. The beautiful redhead is Mary Jane Watson. The guy is Harry Osborne, my best friend. They stuck with me after Uncle Ben died. Harry's dad, Norman, was great too. I got a job with the Daily Bugle, taking pictures of... myself. Life sure is strange sometimes. No matter how much you want to hold on to a moment, you can't stop time from moving on. This game is so classic, man. General Slocum has given Oscorp a week to prove that we can develop a working serum. Or we are going to lose the contract to Quest Labs, given how much we have invested in this research. Losing the contract could bankrupt Oscorp. I can only assume that Spider-Man relates to our problem in some way. <clears throat> yes, oh, uh, Mr. Oscorp, that is not a natural conclusion as at all. That video showed Spider-Man possesses all the attributes our project hopes to create. We hypothesize that he has augmented spider DNA in his system and feel certain that an analysis of his blood will enable us to complete our serum. We can modify the hunter killers to track this DNA signature and capture Spider-Man. They're called hunter Do killers. It. That's a subtle name. How did you ever get approved from by the city to make that? Well, if I want to get paid this week, I'd better come up with some photos for Jonah. The city's been quiet, so I guess I'm going to have to settle for some aerial acrobatics. I can get in some practice while I'm at it. Oh, I love it, man. The graphics of this game are actually really good. Like, I mean, not good, but, you know, I like how they look. They're charming. I really love this series. I love how it looks in this game. I should start with my web breaking. If I jump while I'm swinging, I can totally change direction and start swinging again. <laughs> Couple of nice shots. But nothing JJ's gonna pay top dollar for. I need to get a little fancier. Got it. Huh. That was okay. But the shots need more action. Got you, boss man. It is a little bit weird, isn't it, how Oscorp is developing their serum now after Spider-Man's already established? Because in the movie, Green Goblin's origin is like the same day as Spider-Man getting bitten. Which is interesting. Okay, I have those shots for JJ. Gotta get back to the bugle, collect my money, and get my rent paid. Uh-oh. I don't know what that thing is, but something tells me it isn't friendly. It must be a peaceful and friendly robot. That's why it's named Hunter Killer. Whoa. Hey, back off. These guys are really persistent. Really persistent after sending more than one. Hey, I didn't know the spider ones were in this level. I thought those only appeared in the Scorpion mission. That's cool. He's falling down to the streets though. Sure are a lot of them. 
Come on. We got this. Take him out. I love how they're like, yeah, Spider-Man's uh, genetic makeup resembles our this new formula that we're trying to make. Let's send our robots to go kill him. Like, what? Why don't you either capture him or just, like, go ask him somehow. Like, ask him where he got his powers from. No guarantees that he would tell you, but still. There's got to be easier ways. Are you guys recyclable? You aren't from the future or something lame like that, right? Finally. That's the last of them. But who sent them? I couldn't tell you, pal. Alright, I think that's going to end off this first part of Spider-Man 2002, the movie game. I really like this game. It's very hard. It's a lot harder than I remember, but I guess I've just never played it on this mode before. So, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more. If you really like this game, let me know and I'll cover some more.